Hey Cancer, September is set to be a wild ride for your money and your career. The cosmos are aligning in some really, really intense ways and you won't want to miss what this moon has in store for us this month, Cancer, okay? Today I'm going to be diving deep into your astrological energy, pulling some tarot cards and revealing the secrets around your financial future, okay? At least for the month of September. Whether you're ready to make some big moves or just hoping to survive the chaos, trust me, you'll want to stick around to hear what all the universe has planned for you spoiler alert is going to be a game changer okay welcome or welcome back to the cancerian vibe i am she the boss lady b thank you so so much for joining me anything you want to know about me the channel personal readings one-on-one -on -one sessions all that good stuff can be found in the description box below by typing my website into your web browser bossladybtarot.com or um like I said, checking out the description box below. If you want to join my tarot club, you can check out this link here in the eye um, and take you to my store where you can find out more information about that cancer. Okay, I just want to give the disclaimer to let you know that there are timestamps down below. Okay, they're down on the video, down in the description box. Um, but I do got to give y'all a little bit of astrology around your money this month. Okay, me personally, I, <clears throat> I study astrology. I feel like it's very relevant. I'm going to share astrology. If you don't like it, please just don't tell me about it in my comments. Like, that's kind of really, really irritating me. So I just had to assert that, you know, we're talking about communication being very important for us this month to Cancer um, for the month of September. If you missed the reading that I did on this new moon in Virgo, the energy is still here. The energy is still relevant. Definitely check that out. If I can remember, I'll drop the um, reading right there. Or just go back to the channel and check it out, Cancer. But like I said, there are several significant astrological transits in September that could impact your money and career, Cancer. Okay, the first being Pluto's being retrograde in Capricorn. This is the last time that it's going to be in Capricorn for our lifetime. This is um, until October 11th, okay? And Pluto being in Capricorn, our, our opposite sign, it rules our seventh house of partnerships, contracts, cancer. Pluto retrograde can really bring transformations and reveal hidden aspects in partnerships or business agreements. Um, you may want to reevaluate your professional relationships, your contracts, collaborations that you're doing. You may potentially uncover some power dynamics or some financial matters that really need to be addressed. Okay. Um, the new moon in Virgo happened. Like I said, that's really relevant. I put more information in its own separate um, video because anything dealing with the, um, the moon cancer, you know, is relevant to us. Okay. This new moon in Virgo um, falls in cancer's third house of communication ideas and your local community this is a really really powerful time to set those new intentions cancer related to networking marketing um anything any type of communication in the workplace all right cancers you may find that new opportunities for growth by leveraging your skills um in communication or organization so lean into communication it's going to be your superpower this month okay um, Mars enters Cancer on, on September the 4th. Mars is going to be in our sign. All right. That, that is going to bring you a little bit of burst of energy and motivation, Cancer. So that transit is going to be really significant for your career money because it's going to boost your ambition. Okay. You're going to be ambitious, assertive. You're going to have that desire to take initiative. All right. So, um, However, you know, Mars and Cancer can also bring a bit of emotional responses to career challenges. So it's really, really important, Cancer, for you to kind of balance that energy wisely. Okay. Then the next moon event, we got the full moon and lunar eclipse and a fellow water sign of Pisces. This is going to happen on the 17th of September. This full moon eclipse is going to fall in our ninth house, Cancer, of higher education, travel, broad perspectives. Um, eclipses often bring significant changes, okay, in endings, significant changes and endings, Cancer. So you might experience a shift in your career goals, especially if it involves like international work or like traveling, like long distances or whatever. Um, 
this could be definitely with higher education or anything publishing publishing something this eclipse could bring a light to new information that's going to change your career trajectory or open up a brand new financial path for you cancer so this eclipse we're going to talk more about it but this is the game changer of the month okay um then libra season is going to start on the 22nd okay so as the sun moves into libra cancer our fourth house of home and foundations is going to be active that transit can impact your career decisions particularly if you um if they're like related to work-life balance or um if you have like a home-based business cancer or you're making career moves that affect like your family okay it might be a really really good time to consider how your career choices align with your personal values and your family needs like there may be some shifts in your family um you know where you're having to take on another job or do something different you may have to switch around your schedule. So just be open to how you're going to have to find balance when Libra season pops in on us, okay? When Mercury enters Libra on the 22nd, y'all, that's going to impact our fourth house as well. That's going to help enhance the communication about home and family matters. For career, this might mean um, discussions about working remotely, um, negotiating like work from home setups, or making decisions about relocating for a job, Cancer. Okay. Financial discussions within the family or investments in property could also be highlighted during this time. Okay. So all of these transits in indicate a month of potential change and opportunities in career and finance for us cancers it's time to be a little bit more mindful of our emotions maintain maintain clear like communication cancer and be open to all the transformative opportunities okay we're gonna dive deeper into the cards and get some more insight about what you can expect what you need to know what you need to be doing in september as it pertains to your money and career you guys i'm gonna start off pulling a prosperity message that will um lean into at the end of the reading so definitely make sure you stick around for your prosperity message you guys thank you for those of you that um are here and love the content that i put out and just give good energy i really really appreciate it i pray that it um comes back to you tenfold you guys leave me a little residue of your energy on my thumbs up but and that's always appreciated too okay but we're gonna pull the prosperity message for september 2024 for cancer spirit prosperity message for cancer september 2024 choose that one right there we got yang the energy of yang here at the bottom of the deck it's the number one card so um already feeling some beginner energy okay cancer but let's get into the nitty-gritty of it let's look at the overall energy surrounding your money your career in september thank you for clear accurate messages for my cancerian spirit all my cancer placements what's the overall energy surrounding our money career for the month of September. All right, we got Anchor showing up, Cancer. So look, um, and I feel like this overall energy, because it's Anchor, it talks about um, there being some type of money blockages or you could be feeling stuck. Cause you know, when you think about an Anchor, an Anchor is holding a ship or something in place. It's holding something in place. But also um, there's this energy of feeling financially sound. So I feel like there's gonna be, um, that's that shift that we're talking about. And especially with that eclipse that's coming in this month, where you could feel like there was some type of blockage, especially, you know, coming off this retrograde. Um, communication is, is very much, you know, just getting back on track. So things could still be a little um, delayed, but... Um, definitely, I feel like the overall energy is stability. I feel like a stable September. That's what I'm feeling. That's what I'm more so feeling. There could, we'll talk about money blockages. I'll actually pull out that card, but I feel like this is more so um, stability. Somebody is going, I definitely feel like you're going to be making a decision. This is for some cancer out there about changing, like uprooting yourself or maybe putting roots somewhere else in regards to a job. Some of you cancer may definitely find a job or there's a job where you're going to have to find you find yourself traveling a lot um but definitely i am feeling more so of the stability in in 
uh, September. We got the ring here at the bottom of the deck. And remember, I talked about the um, where you're going to have to reevaluate some type of relationships, contracts, collaborations. All right. This could even be marriage. You're going to have to uh, redo or look at more so um, financial commitments. OK, your your long term goals or what you want to invest in may be changing here to cancer. But there's going to be some changes around your money in regards to like partnerships i know that was a heavy kind of focus back more so last month in august when it was um when when it first kind of was brought up now there's a, a more so um like a a real true hairline focus on it cancer but yeah somebody i feel like there's either going to be dissolving or partnerships or collaborations or coming together of new ones even new um partnerships as far as marriage um in that sense another person but yeah let's get into the rest of the tea for september we're gonna look and see what key opportunities might present themselves what opportunities may present themselves in September for Cancer? What key opportunities does Cancer in their professional life? So, and I knew it was going to show up because I definitely felt like it was at the bottom of the deck before I started showing it. But definitely, okay, the communication factor is important, Cancer. You have something, I just caught 11 11 too. You have a story to tell, you have something to share. Um, this would be a good time, Cancer. If you've been thinking about any type of careers and type of, in public um, relations, communications, radio, I feel like this is more so not even just about your voice, you know, because your voice could be words too. Um, so this is a time if you've been thinking about publishing some type of book or story, this is a time. And I feel like you're going to be presented with an opportunity, okay, to get your message heard, to put yourself out there, to get noticed. So be open to this um, opportunity presenting itself in the month of September for you, okay? The only thing that's going to hold you back from this opportunity is your inability to open up your mouth and speak and stand in your truth, Cancer, okay? Um, I feel like, look, so work hard in silence was here at the bottom of the deck this underlying energy i feel like there has been some things that you've been working on behind the scenes in silence but now spirit is telling you exercise that throat chakra okay it's time to communicate you've been working hard in silence and now um it's time to communicate i feel like definitely and look there's stability showing up so that's what I'm saying. It's giving very much stable September, okay? So your financial future, it definitely looks um, a little bit more promising, Cancer. A lot more stable, a lot more prosperous, okay? I feel like, too, this is where you're going to kind of be able to take a... Um, or have get like a handle of your finances and kind of create that stability that you're looking for. This is the best time to take action on these on this opportunity as far as getting yourself out there. Um, if you've been thinking about like marketing a product, cancer, advertising, like this would be the time, okay? Anything that has to do with the media or anything like that, these opportunities are going to present themselves. And I feel like seize the day, cancer, okay? Seize the day let's see what challenges or obstacles may present themselves what challenges or obstacles might cancer face in their career and find um, financial matters during september spirit what challenges or obstacles might cancer face Oh, I love this kind of challenge. Okay, look, we got a windfall energy showing up. So, and um, so this speaks about you're about to receive a windfall of um, money or a pay raise. But look, y'all, so the underlying energy, and I remember I told y'all this, go back and it's in one of those readings. But the people that you spend the most time with shape who you are. That's what's showing up at the bottom of the deck. And remember, I said, um, one in the astrology, your family, like your family. Um, dynamics and people that you consider your loved ones, your family, they're going to be th that energy. They're going to be um, 
Like it's going to influence the decisions that you make around your career this month, okay? The people that you love, they're going to help dictate how you spend, I feel like, your money too. So I feel like that could be the challenge. Um, also, remember I said that, you know, there is money due to you. We were talking about that blockage, right? There is money due to you, um, but pe certain people could be your blockage, certain energies, certain partnerships that you're in, okay? Um, but there does feel like there is some type of um, windfall or a pay raise that comes for you with it showing up in the challenge um, position, though. It feels like you may either believe it's not true and that can work against you because you have to believe that you're worthy, Cancer. You have to, you know, believe in this opportunity. But um, also, too, I feel like, you know, it could feel so positive that you could kind of get carried away. Um, you know, it's a great time to, if you want to make some type of like purchase or whatever, but it, you don't want to go overboard. Okay. Um, and you don't want to be around people that are going to take from you in the way there, I have to say this very delicate because there's still that energy of you having to be that person this month, cancer, where it's like you are, you know, on the like you're giving charity, okay? Like someone may need you, but you also want to be mindful and aware of people that just are bleeding you dry. And it may not even just be in regards to your money, but um, your energy too, because your energy is like currency as well. All right, but that you know, yeah, with the windfall, I feel like that's a it's a it's a good. Oh, and look at that! So we done busted out the um the prosperity message. We'll get to that, but I definitely feel like. Um, the challenge with the windfall being a challenge, you know, things could be a little bit worse. I just feel like you're going to now, it's like who much is given, much is required. So I feel like with the more that you're given, the more, you know, you're going to be required of. And that could be the challenge for you there. Let's see what steps you need to take to improve your financial stability in September. Let's get some financial insight. What steps can cancer take? To improve their financial stability in September. So, oh, okay, we got unethical showing up here. Um, and so, remember, I said standing in your truth. That's the steps that you're gonna have to take. Um, and I don't feel like this unethical is like you're maliciously lying. Um, but I feel like this is definitely the time. Like, you have to stand in your truth. You have to be authentically you, and you have to find like you have to follow your path that's true to you. I feel like also too, spirit is saying, you know, with your voice speak up like um being silent i feel like it's going to be unethical okay um you also do want to make sure that um that's what i said too remember i said there's somebody there could be people around you that are being unethical i feel like somebody could find that out you could find out some type of secret especially around the eclipse time like the middle of the month you could find that someone's being unethical about their money um, or about money in your situation, or you want to be very careful about who you tell or talk to, especially about this windfall that may happen or this pay raise that, that has happened. Um, and also just know that you don't have to do anything. It's like stay in flow when it comes to your abundance. Know that you don't have to move. Like you don't have to um, do anything like any type of get rich scheme or anything unethical out of the box or, you know, whatever to access the abundance that you're asking for. Okay. Whatever type of, um, blockage. Cause I feel like it's definitely, there definitely was a blockage. Cause it's like this windfall, you know, when you're like stopped up and then you finally get something to kind of just help you get cleaned out. You know how that go cancer. That's what it kind of feel like. And it could feel like, it's funny that if you picked up what I was putting down as far as with that little, yeah. Um, it's funny that that was the example because with this windfall being, it's like it could come with a lot of ish. You know what I mean? Just saying. <laughs> but um, definitely, I feel like opening up your mouth, Cancer. And don't, it's like, don't lie. Don't, like the card says, don't lie. But I feel like omitting the truth or not standing in your truth or not being assertive. That's just that's just like a lie. And so that's the steps that that's the step that you need to take. That's what's going to help you in your stability cancer is you speaking up for yourself, okay? 
How can Cancer enhance their career prospects this month? How can, ooh, all right. So look, entertainer. So yeah, Cancer, you're definitely supposed to be out there in the public being seen, okay? Um, this would be the time to really put yourself out there and bring, um, you know, get noticed, okay? If you've been thinking about doing some type of podcast or something that's in the entertainment field where you would be using your voice, this is definitely a good time. Um, any type of career around like theater, dancing, music, that kind of thing. Any type of entertainment. I feel like, you know, it's time. Like your stage is here. Your opportunity is here. Um, there's also uh, cancer. You need to be leaning into the talents that you realize that you have, the gifts that you have and talents that you have. That's how you're going to en enhance your career prospects this month. And remember, we talked about in the astrology how you can leverage your communication skills, okay? Um, leverage your skill, you know, your other soft skills or any other skills to kind of help you move up the ladder or do something Thing new so definitely lean into that this month cancer but i'm telling you putting yourself out there is going to be the key this month in september that's going to be the key let's actually see what actions what actions should cancer take to seize these career opportunities in september so look promoting yourself so i'm definitely telling you cancer look and take action is here at the bottom of the deck i'm telling you if you've been thinking about start that podcast okay start that youtube channel whatever it is start writing that blog whatever you've been thinking about cancer when it comes to um like getting yourself out there getting what you have to say off your chest put it out there spirit is definitely saying yes and not only just put it out there like promote it okay don't just like throw it out into the abyss and no like it's like ring your bell make people look at you okay um there's a new idea or project manifesting and i feel like it's definitely has great potential for success around um communication okay so any type of entertainment even if you're thinking about being some type of like literal promoter in regards to like entertaining people okay this could even be in the restaurant energy um industry but um definitely just being in this space cancer where i feel like you're putting yourself out there taking action and saying yes saying yes to these ideas that you're receiving okay do not let these opportunities pass you by cancer the actions that you need to take this month is that's what i'm saying promote it promote your services cancer promote um your art promote whatever it is like i need you to walk around with a t-shirt on a bag everything it's like you're a walking billboard for yourself you need to be promoting yourself in september all right promote 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 all right what warnings do the cards have for cancer regarding their career or their financial decisions in september any warnings advice advice warning okay hold on Uh oh, and beware showed up and see, I'm, I'm telling you it's about somebody around you that I feel like is, is not who they say they are. They may have a different motivation, um, but also too with beware falling up under the windfall. I feel like there is going to be a very 180 change in your finances, cancer, and it could feel so optimistic that you're like, okay, I got all this money coming in. You could even feel like you're getting money from different and newer sources, but you still want to be mindful. You still want to be prudent. Um, around your finances and I'm not saying you know act like you have out of lack but I am acting I'm saying act as though you have like a budget a set budget so it's like just because you're making all this much more money in September doesn't mean that you should go spending that much more money in September okay and remember you want to be very very careful who you speak to okay be, um, speak to about your money your business your business matters communication you want to be very 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 mindful okay Okay, um, in the month of September. And again, it's showing up. The people that you spend the most time with is like, you want to be careful talking to your coworkers this month. Um, you know, telling them any type of business, telling them about your ideas, because you you're getting downloaded with new ideas that are gonna be very successful, gonna be money makers, and it may be somebody that's just listening to try to take from you, cancer. So be mindful, okay. Um, or somebody that sh somebody is around you trying to keep you stuck in the place that you're in and you're trying to grow, bust out of it, right? Um, 
be be mindful of that. Be mindful of people that are uh, want you to make financial commitments to them, or just be just be mindful of other people, the people that you're spending the most time with. Okay, just be aware. Like that was the warning. I asked about the warning, and Spirit just said, "Beware, beware of people lying to you, or like the." Yeah, because the unethical energy or like people saying one thing but doing another. Yeah, be mindful of that. Cancer, let's see. How can cancer use their intuition to make better career and financial decisions this month? Our intuition, our intuition is our power, superpower. All right, so look, um, intuitive planning, intuitive planning. And you know, that's so funny because I've been doing just that, okay? Um, and we have the anim animal energy here. So it talks about your intuition, your instinct, okay? Um, so definitely this is on point. Using your instincts to help you plan out, paying attention to the detail. We talked about Virgo season being very much, you need to be very much mindful of the details, okay? Create a plan to grow your business or your personal finances. Stick to that plan. Get some type of anchorage, okay? Um, I feel like any type of... Like you need to be planning how you're promoting yourself or throwing it out there, like throwing yourself out there this this month, Cancer. Okay, this is a really really, really good time to kind of also take stock of what needs to change around your finances. Um, you know, your intuition. I feel like is gonna help you to connect with your spirit animal too. That's gonna help you improve your finances. That's gonna help you make those business decisions. As long as you follow your instincts when making business decision, Cancer, and and you know, not necessarily making too um, impulsive of decisions, but more so planning out your actions. That's what's going to. Um, that's what's going to help you make the best decisions that you need to this month in um in September. So I'm gonna pull. I like how this um how the prosperity message showed up already. But yeah, I am seeing something with partnerships, Cancer. I don't know um whoever you share finances with. There's going to be some some changes, some dynamic changes in that you may find yourself uh, ending those commitments or restructuring those commitments. What's relevant for cancer, money and career and September spirit? What else does cancer need to know? So know that, look, you have everything that you need to be um, a success, Cancer. I feel like this is a very creative time around um, for you, Cancer. This is the time to create those um, ideas and those visions that you have about that podcast, okay? I'm definitely seeing that. Like someone may definitely be wanting to do a podcast or start some type of YouTube channel. Anything in like mass communications, I feel like. And it doesn't even have to be mass communications, but you could be thinking, oh, I don't have the equipment. I don't know where to start or something like that. But know that you have everything that you need to be successful. It's in you or within reach, okay? In you or within reach. Um, I just tweeted that today. Look, your success in, is inevitable. It's a it's given successful September. Okay, successful stable um, September. We're feeling it. What else is relevant for Cancer? Money and career. So create one it to pop out. But look, partner up one plus one. That's what I'm saying. I do feel like some of you may be joining. Um, having like there may be a conjoining a joining of a partnership like a coming together where you're creating something um where it's going to create a financial i could definitely see where this would be a baby for someone because it's like you're coming together that's a family thing because there's a heavy tie into your family with your finances and career this month so this could look like adding to the family having you know to make adjustments around um, adding to your family in that sense, you know, having to kind of scale back or change your schedule around, but um, also to collaborations and things that you may be um, working on cancer. I feel like definitely there's going to be some shakeups or changes around that. Let's pull one more. Messages of relevancy for cancer, September spirit. So put in work, okay? Yeah, definitely the work is time to take action. It's time to put in the work. This is giving that Virgo energy, okay? 
cancer um and also like i said this is a really good time if you've been thinking about learning anything being a student work with a mentor getting some type of mentor or coach or taking some type of class this is a great time to add to your knowledge okay that's a part of communication as well um to cancer look i knew i was supposed to pick it up uh that's what i feel like to this windfall money it feels like there's a boost in your finances but it's like you know how um like store up for winter it's like you know you should be moving a little bit smarter with your finances because you probably moved out of a a period where your finances were very chaotic and it's like you learn from that experience to put yourself in a better situation in regards to your finances and i'm not just saying that's going to be a 180 overnight it very well could be but if it's not don't get discouraged by that but it is going to be a transformation in how you handle money how money is attracted to you um vice versa and how you plan your money okay work with your plan pay attention to the details set your goals y'all set smart goals ones that are measurable ones that have actionable steps behind it you know you can have as many goals as you want but a goal without um all the other necessary um planning stuff yeah it's just a goal okay um it's, it's like a booty hole everybody got one all right just saying all right but so um as you can see the uh, prosperity messages is treasure island card the number nine and i love that it's like this tortoise because i feel like there's been this message cancer of you slowly but steady getting ahead and i know it i know you your ego may make it feel anxious and like you like you're racing to kind of get to this place but no you're making the perfect time and i also feel like look it's a number nine card number nine month it feels as though um i love that the water is shown here too because even though things are Around you may be movable like you know the water bends and moves and it's forever changing and flowing that anchor you're set it's like you're set you're anchored down you're stable you're good okay that that water can slosh and slish it's like you're not gonna fall backwards okay that's what i'm seeing in this prosperity message i'm gonna read the actual prosperity message but um number nine the number nine card definitely just feeling like um with the treasure island you know and we're talking about the law of attraction too we've been talking um a lot about the law of attraction to cancer and how it can help you kind of bring your dreams into fruition um how your positive thinking can help you make um manifest it's going to be really important that you do so okay i feel like yeah with this windfall the challenge y'all it's gonna be like with treasure island showing up too i feel like there's gonna be some abundance that kind of appears at um like from nowhere it's gonna feel like it came out of nowhere okay some type of financial um gains that comes out of nowhere but i am feeling like you're gonna have to share it you're gonna have to share your fortune in some type of way okay it's like you got this little treasure you're gonna have to share it in some type of way okay so just be mindful about that um and so I'm going to read the relationship message and the prosperity message because, yeah, the partnership was showing up. So the relationship message here says that re your relationship is a treasure providing even more than you need, but you may not see that right now, okay? No matter how long you've been together, you and your partner are always discovering hidden gems about yourselves and each other. Now is a time of discovery. It is as if everything is in sync and everything is new again, okay? Romance blooms and love is in the air you can be assured that this is a partnership that brings you great gifts and valuable lessons keep your heart open cancer the message of this card is to celebrate love and what it teaches you so like i said i do feel like there's a new union being formed for someone i'm gonna come back and do a love reading i promise y'all okay i know y'all had asked for it um, the prosperity message here says that at the, at this time you can be confident that success is yours i told y'all that um, your success is inevitable. That's the that's the quote. That's the quote that I had um, tweeted earlier. Y'all put it down in the comment section. Claim it for yourself. Your success is inevitable. Like no matter what happens, you have to be successful. That's what that's what it says. Okay, your art, your ideas are all hitting the mark, and you're in true manifestation period when you um when you will see evidence of the seeds of your prosperity that you planted in the past the appearance of this card in a reading indicates that your dreams and aspirations align with concrete signs 
anchor signs, okay? A prosperity in the world of form. This is a very auspicious and fortunate time for business, Cancer. Creative projects will flourish um, as inspiration strikes you. Share your wealth with others, too. Generosity and gratitude should lead you now. Remember, y'all, I told y'all y'all was gonna have to share. And, and it was so funny because I had literally had to have that message deliver it to myself first because I was so irritated. I was like, why is everybody asking me for money? But you want to be like, it would be a blessing to be able to be in a place to be able to share. Um, and I feel like you are going to be in a place where you're able to share cancer. So let gratitude, you know what it was when you felt the struggle. Okay. But also don't let people use you and abuse you. Be Now, if you can't do something, no is a complete sentence. Assert yourself. If um, Don't be given to people that have just taken, taken, taken. You know what I mean? Um, but we've been talking about it. Like I said, these ideas that you're bringing in cancer, money making. I need Need you to get on them I, and they need to be just more than ideas we need to be working actively working to make them real okay this is a time to promote yourself this is like i'm telling you if you put yourself out there it's like sales could go up services book can go up like promote 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 put yourself out there cancer don't tell don't say I ain't never tell you nothing because I just gave you all the tea, okay? If you're trying to learn something, this is a month. Do it. This is the last quarter of the year. Make it count, okay? In the meantime, Cancer, I'm going to leave it right here. Um, talk to me down in the comments. Like I said, claim it. Your success is inevitable. My success is inevitable. Write it down in the comment section. Make it real. Make it plain, okay? Um, talk to me in the comment section, you guys. If you're interested in a, um, a reading, if you want a money and career, career reading for your own September, um, or if you have a specific question, you guys, definitely check out the website. Check the link in the description box below. All the good stuff, okay? But, of course, make sure you're subscribed, you know, notification bell is turned on because i'll be back real soon in the meantime in between time until next time i love you